Now let's see. This question is from at Brian Hedgehog. Ugh, not another hedgehog. To Shadow and Sonic, do you hate each other? Okay, come on now. Shadow doesn't hate Sonic. Right? Yeah, what do you say, Shadow? Do you hate me? I like how Roger just said, like, do you hate me? He like said, like, 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 taunting to him. Like, do you hate me? Go ahead, say that. Let's see. Come on. I dare you to say it. Come on. Come on. Do it. Go ahead, do it. <laughs> what? Do it. <laughs> Well, let's see. Your methods are usually annoying. Your jokes fall flat. Your skills lack discipline. You constantly see the best in people to your own detriment. And you have terrible taste in footwear. Oh! Damn! shoes. I kind of want to wear them, but I actually prefer Amy's boots. If you guys can't tell, I'm a boot girl. Oh, uh, ow. Why did I do that? But no, I don't hate you. You hear that, Sonic? Shadow doesn't hate you. Wait, but but he said so many mean things. So... I heard he doesn't hate you. Oh, that's wonderful to hear, Shadow. It takes a brave man to admit you don't hate someone. You... Uh -huh, uh -huh, mm -hmm. Yeah, he doesn't hate him. Yeah, sure. Why the fuck you lying? Why you always lying? Mm, oh my god. Stop fucking lying. You have my respect, Shadow. <laughs> Guys, but it, clearly, but happy to have settled that once and for all. And thanks for the question, Brian Hedgehog. <laughs> they're like, just like, they're basically trying to be like, move along, people. Nothing to say here. Move along. Sonic Nuck Real asks, what's your favorite Sonic game? Asking for a friend. Sonic game? What is this person even talking about? Oh, you haven't heard of a Sonic game? Folks around the world hear of our adventures and make plenty of media about them. Some just happen to be games. I don't know how to play these games anymore. <laughs> is there a bridge game or a punch? <laughs> more well, I've played a couple of them. I'm not very good at it, but my favorite is Sonic Heroes. Shadow the Hedgehog for me. Bias? So maybe like Sonic Heroes. I prefer Sonic Unleashed because the Werehog is too fluffy. Hold on, wait, hold on a minute. Werehog! Werehog fluffy. You know what? If we're gonna hold right here, you're just gonna sit right here in my lap. Enjoy this chat. Enjoy this reaction video with me. Yeah, shocker. I'm partial to Sonic Frontiers. I think a lot of people will enjoy that adventure. <laughs> Are there any games about me? Where's my game? You don't get one. You suck. Oh, and by the way, you guys suck! Robotics Mean Bean Machine, if you want to count that. Mean Bean? You mean a game about my mean beans? <laughs> Bollocks. I demand a new game. One regular is so. That's a new one. Wait, hold on. What does Bollocks mean? Hold on. Let's look that up. Step in my path with my big sword. Oh, uh, and nunchucks. Uh, yeah, nunchucks to compliment my big sword. Uh, uh, then I'll take the big sword. Okay, right? okay, okay. I'm sure every game developer is getting right on that, Iggy. For now, thanks so much for the question, at Sonic Nut Real. This question comes from at Bull Ram. Okay. Why is there so many spaces that is just nuts? Knuckles, do you ever get bored of guarding the Master Emerald? If you do, how do you entertain yourself? Hmm. I have found myself restless lately, but my resolve to guard the Master Emerald is absolute. I do not falter in my mission. 
Yeah, but you gotta get bored, right? I mean, do you play any games? Tic-tac-toe? I spy? Maybe, uh, go for a walk and leave the emerald unguarded, huh? No, it is always under my watch. However, I have been collecting rocks that look like animals. I have a couple with me. <gasps> oh my gosh, wait, this is actually cool. This rock looks like a bird. Look, up in the sky, it's a bird. It's a plane. It's on sea. Oh, oh, look at this one. It's a little pig. What's this one? A uh, slice of pizza? That's a rabbit. Yeah, I don't get this. Keep your rocks. I guess you don't want to see the best rock I found. what you say, Egghead. Calm down, guys, calm down. You're alive, Eggman. I don't want to rethink that. And uh, thanks for the question, that bull ram. This one seems to be for Eggman. From Bobo 76 Land <laughs> to the esteemed Dr. Eggman. How did you survive so long in cyberspace? I was wondering this myself. You were trapped in one area for a long time. You all must know my secrets. I pack a lunch before an evil scheme. It's time there's a baloney on rye. Actually, I can't fault in there because um, I'm hyperglycemic. And, uh, and when my blood sugar goes low, I get very sick. The baby carrots and one of those irresistible galaxy brownies. What are you, three years? Galaxy brownies? Old. What kind of lunch is that? Don't give me any lift, Shadow. I survived for days on baby carrots. Neil has a perfect amount of sustenance to fuel my powerful mind. Oh, are you sure you didn't pack a toy with that happy meal? <laughs> <laughs> Get him, Tails. Your mom didn't leave a note in there, too, did she? Leave my mom out of this. What happened when you ran out of baby carrots? Did you switch to elbow slices? <laughs> 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 Last time I tell any of you any secrets, don't ask any questions again. Bobo 76 land. Reveal more. Do it. Alrighty, at Evoltex asks to Amy, what's your favorite dessert? Ooh. Oh, that's a tough one. <laughs> I do love sweet. I'm dessert. Dessert. D -d dessert. Partial to mint flavor desserts, like peppermint cookies. Mint. A freaking. Guys, I haven't had that many mints. Tails, there are three empty mint tins on the floor around you. Look at five. Tails, stop! That's a comical amount of mints! I enjoy a good chocolate egg myself. <laughs> Um, Aggie Ball Tex was asking me here. Okay, I would have to say... Oh, ice cream sundaes for me. <laughs> I have a lot of memories enjoying those. Mom? Tiramisu in a cold night with a warm coffee. There's no better coffee. Mom? Um, guys, I... Has everyone ever had those cotton candy grapes? Oh, those are outstanding. I, uh... No, I don't think I've had those. <gasps> oh, have you ever had those tiny... Strawberry shortcake! <sighs> Strawberry short cake. That is my favorite dessert. Oh, that's a good one. It's a respectable answer. Gotta say, that's delicious. Mm, great choice. Uh, boys, thank you for your question at Evoltex. Strawberry shortcake sucks! <laughs> Down below, though, says, Hey, gang, Hype Guy here. Last year, you all handed me a crazy roast that I never even got to hear. Edgar, so... Hold on. What's the roast? I might have to go back after this reaction video and justify what the roast was. If anyone knows what the roast is, you can
Because I'm not for sure if I can remember what the roast was. Did I get an apology? A <laughs> roast? <laughs> I remember. Never ask for an apology. That never works out. Remember every roast I've ever given, and none of them were to this games cage fellow. Yeah, I don't remember this being a thing, but, uh, sorry. I was in a really dark place, and I'm learning from my actions, and moving forward, and growing, and... What else do people normally say in these apology videos? Is this where I fake cry now? You just got roasted! Yeah! James Cage? I was watching his stream the other day, and he said some pretty rude things about Tails. Wait, what? What did I do? He's talking channels! They're stalking channels now, oh my god. He must know something we don't know! Hey! No one messes with our fox boy. Yeah, that's pretty like much stuff. Only I'm allowed to be mean to these little punks. Whoa, did you hear that? That was weird. Who was that? You've really done it now, Fidel. Well, that was weird. I'm gonna pretend I didn't hear that. Anyway, thanks for the question on the down low, though. I'm sorry for whatever I did, Fidel. I hope you can forgive me. Please. Poor Tails! King Cage, how could you? Be nice to Tails. He didn't do jack to you. He's sweet. This question's from at Arcmantic. How often do you gotta replace your gloves or clean them? That white has to be hard to keep looking fresh like they always do. <laughs> Hold on. Oh, no! No! That's the red wine, the most sustaining thing. Oh, uh, you're not getting that out. Yeah. That's why! Oh, uh, each person's hands stay pristine thanks to the special polymer I sprayed on everyone's gloves. You just can't stop inventing. I must admit, it's worked wonders. Mine have stayed spick and span. Eh, I want some of that polymer. My gloves get filthy repairing so many of my bad things. <laughs> yeah, my bad. Oh, Knuckles, you told me to remind you about your dentist appointment later this evening. Oh, shoot. Thank you. I have the hardest time remembering. You can try writing it down on your hand. I have a pen. That's a great idea. Let's see. Dentist appointment to Oh, wait. It's not writing. Tails, your polymer. Oh, no. It's too good. Pen won't even mark on your unsilly gloves. Ah, oh, jeez. Now I'll never remember. Right on your arm. literally just reminded you. Oh well, guess I'll miss the appointment and answer more questions here. Oh, that's an excuse. Go to your dentist appointment, get your teeth cleaned and all healthy. Come on, man. Thanks, Ed Arcmantic. Hello, everyone. Lisi Mionare here. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please like and subscribe. Comment down below what you guys think of that. And stay tuned for part three. Hope you guys have a nice day. Bye-bye. Okay.